just for your home just as you reset those clocks for daylight saving times don't forget to give your digital life a tune-up too and that's why in our tech talk with psyche southwell she has come up with some tips to help us declutter our tech yes, one indeed. welcome back thank you it's, it's good been a to minute. see you. you're always so well to put together these Ooh. outfits i could wear this i could rock this i'm coming I to be among stylish people so i've got to represent right and i love that for us <laughs> okay well let's go ahead and jump right in tell me you know we all know where to start when it comes to cleaning out our closet but where do we start when we're talking about our, our digital spaces yeah so when you get done with your closet clean out how about we tackle the cloud storage <laughs> clean out right we're all storing stuff in the cloud, whether that be Google Drive, OneDrive, whatever you're using, when it comes to cloud storage, optimizing that space is crucial, right? So periodically, just review your files, delete what you don't need. You'll be surprised how that saves you space, potentially save you some money, and save you time when you need to find things. I always think of like, where, where to start? <clears throat> you know, is it text messages? Like, what eats up the most space that I should probably start with? I know I got like 50,000 photos in my phone, so is, where, where to? I'm glad you went to the phone. Our mobile devices are kind of like that catch-all drawer that's hard to open. <laughs> we put so much things on there. Yes. Downloads, right? Apps, photos, videos, text messages. Just go through them. What are you not using? What do you no longer need? And delete it. You'll be surprised at how much faster your phone can be when you reduce the storage and then in turn reduce your memory usage. Now, now we know to clear out our digital storage. Now, how can we apply similar principles to manage our smartphones effectively? Yeah, it's a great question. And I like to pinpoint things like security, right? So clearing your browsers. Anyone mm. listening, do it today. You might be surprised just how much of our personal information is stored in our browsers. Login information, cookies, those things that follow you around everywhere, your browser history. So it's really important that you occasionally just clear that browser. And I want to pinpoint passwords because it's 2024, right? I want to recommend that everyone using a pa like saving passwords to use a password generator and a secure storage like one password or last pass because again, it's 2024. We don't want to hear of anyone using passwords like Damon 12345, right? Uh, <laughs> that's ooh, a I no just got called that's out. A no -no. <laughs> <laughs> Not, not that that's my password yeah, no, out no, there. No, wait no, wait no. for all those hackers out there. Okay, now, we hear a lot about, again, like you said, the online security version. So um, do you have any spring clearing tips to enhance that online security outside of just adjusting our passwords? Is there anything? Clear your browser. So your cookies, if you've ever wondered, you've been looking, I don't know, what shoes you're into, like some Gucci mules, and you realize it's following you around everywhere. It's because of those cookies, which are great for marketing teams, yes. but not necessarily always good for you. So want to clear your browsers for cookies and also your browsing history, because so much of your personal data is stored there. So just do it periodically. I didn't even think of that. If I pulled out my phone right now, I usually have it next to me, but I don't. Um, I would go through and open up like the Safari browser and mm -hmm. it'd be like oh, yeah. dating all the way back to like two years ago. And I'm like, oh, I yeah. didn't know this is sitting up. I don't know how yeah. to get rid of it all. So I thank you for giving us some tips to get us through. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna send it over to you here in a second. But if you did miss anything, of course, we're gonna post this segment on firstalert4.com slash live. Get those tips. Do your spring digital cleaning. Okay, now I'm going to turn it over to Ken Laura. Yeah. <laughs>